there is a Columbia bubble for sure. Oh, I would describe the Columbia bubble as, well, the area of our campus that people generally don't leave. I would say that it's most likely because people are like busy going to class and stuff. People work very, 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 very hard and expect to do really well. And I like, I've always worked hard, but here it's like you really have to work to succeed. Upsides, it's definitely more of a college feel. I like having like a college town in the middle of a big city. People are just generally less inclined to leave campus because their lives are here and like people don't necessarily want to like be involved in the bustling city life that like we're kind of removed from up here. It's very much a part of the Columbia experience is the people speaking up for their causes, which I find very admirable, but I don't know how much sway that has in the real world. Sometimes it can be isolating, I guess. It's hard to kind of escape isolation. I live in John Jay, which is a bunch of singles, which sometimes, I mean, I do extracurriculars, but when those, those are have like a lull, it's just, it's really easy to not see people, which is not great. You know, you could just go to the library and go to your room and go to the dining halls and not see anybody. And that's not a good thing. I feel old because I feel like everybody, for the most part, is, is an undergrad on this campus. Um, I enjoy having a closed community actually. It separates us from the city a little bit and gives us uh, you know, a more well-defined campus that we can come home to every day.